And the question that emerges from like the boring infrastructure person is, the bank should not be driving this conversation. I think we're all agreed there, but they're a big component in delivering the solutions. The solutions that need to be highly nuanced in terms of both the morality, the intervention, the self-selection and the net impact. The investment that will need to be made in the technology that permits that is something that the banks will have to carry and the regulator will absolutely um, help drive that and and to joe's point it's available it's not rocket science at this point but the reality is that we are very often looking to banking institutions to provide answers to provide solutions i'm seeing some very interesting questions coming through around what are banks doing and you know should we have um the sort of if this then that type of opt-in so you can create your own rules and the reality is i'd rather not leave that to a product designer inside a bank i'd rather take the insights I'm hearing in this conversation that layer the multiple interconnected issues that have to be solved and say, hello, bank, you're part of the solution, but you can't drive because you're a commercial organization and you'll be looking at where you can make money out of this. Um, and you can't drive on the moral discussions because that's not your position, but you can participate in those discussions and hopefully we'll get you to a place where servicing vulnerable com um, um, customers and vulnerable communities is something you can do as part of your normal business without a massive discount on profitability.